everyone, this is Diani Ashley and today we are going to be interviewing some of the people here at Co-op Gaming Lounge for the final Tekken 7 tournament. Hello, my name is Dani and my IGN is Dani Soya. I'm playing with um, DRP Jinmei and Primivir. And our team name is Unholy Ballerina Chiropractor. <laughs> so what's your best memory with Tekken 7? Hmm. My best memory with Tekken 7 is that I won my first tournament at school. It was at senior high probably around 2011. Oh. Because I practiced Tekken 7 for like three months mm -hmm. in my room alone. Who's the character that you hate the most in Tekken 7? Mmm! <laughs> Lucky Chloe! <laughs> oh yeah! Because her mix-ups are crazy and then she's like counting. <laughs> what are you looking forward to in Tekken 8? Everyone's play styles look varied in Tekken 8 because the heat system is like a game changer. So I'm looking forward to what are the new stuff I can use with King and everyone else. Mm. Hello, uh, my name is Patricia Savinit and I'm Primivir. Mm -hmm. um, what's your best memory with Tekken 7? Oh, that's hard. Probably the first time I got on stage at an international tournament, which was in Rev Major 2019. Mm -hmm. So that was the first time I was able to go up on stage in front of all <laughs> my idols, oh. Korean pros and everyone. And like, I played badly, but uh, it was the best just... experience of my life. And then I met my my friends, like all my other female players mm -hmm. that I'm now in a team with. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm really happy I got to meet them. And you too. Wow. I got to meet such awesome real players. I, I felt lonely before, so mm -hmm. now I don't feel lonely because I have you guys yeah. and I have them. So. Who's the character that you hate the most in Tekken 7? Jeez, Akuma, Negan. <laughs> so, DLCs. DLCs. <laughs> Kuni <laughs> meets. <laughs> Some of us are like Chloe Jensen. No, actually, no. Okay. no yes. What are you looking forward to in Tekken 8? Oh, this is the first time I'm playing Tekken. We're in at the start, mm -hmm. at the release of yeah. the game. I know how to play mm -hmm. properly, so I'm excited how much more I could learn, more friends I could meet, or like more events that I could attend with friends. So probably that. Okay, my name is Jamil, and my IGN is Jinmei. <laughs> I'm playing with Bad, aka from a beer, and Danny, Danny Soya. So and the yeah. team name is <laughs> Unholy Ballerina <laughs> Chiropractor. Okay. And it's basically an all mishmash of our yeah. games. But I screwed it and I played somebody else. <laughs> Wait, who are you playing today? I played the old man, because he's dead oh, in the next game. Oh yeah. <laughs> so what's your best memory with Tekken 7? Uh for me, I would say well, Tekken 7 was my first game oh, that yeah, I took seriously, yeah. but it, it all it all culminated when I got to finally play me in Pastels, oh. and he was one of the two double gents I was watching oh. to get inspired. And the other one was Kyodons, but he was not there anymore. <laughs> but it was really surreal to like really play Pastels with him, and I didn't even expect to like have it that yeah. close at all, but it was amazing since it was also his main character, Brian. It was like very good. Yeah. Who's the character that you hated the most in Tekken 7? I, okay, like it originally was Akuma or Leroy, but now I'm like I'm so sorry to everyone who made, who likes this character. It's Kunimitsu. No. <laughs> I like her design, yeah, but yeah, yeah, I'm it. so sorry playing against this character is uh, yeah. mentally not okay. Okay, okay. <laughs> what are you looking forward to in Tekken 8? I just want to play my main character, DVJ, oh. and I, I can't wait. And I'm just waiting for his trailer. My name is Luis Martin Olegre, and my IGN is Bakal Nation. And who are you playing with today? 20V. My best memory of Tekken 7 is the post-tournament eats. Kunya nang sasang gyup kami o aalis kami. Not necessarily the game, pero yung what happens after the game. So, who is the character that you hate the most in Tekken 7? Ah, uh, wala naman. Al al alam ko lata. Alam ko kakatalo ko lang kanina pero ah, uh, I think uh, wala naman talaga ng literal na hate. Sila so, natatalo lang talaga ako. Uh, what are you looking forward to in Tekken 8? Ah, uh, sana bumalik si Mardok pero 
sana mag-grow din yung community kasi, I mean, medyo marami na nga rin tayo. Pero what if mas dumami pa and mas ma-promote pa yung game? So, madami talaga lang. My name is Paul Gabriel Fuentes, but people know me as Porokun. I'm here to cast a tournament, to provide commentary for the tournament, basically. What is your best memory with Tekken 7? My best memory for Tekken 7 would have to be, I guess, the first time that I got to do commentary for it. Because, uh, honestly, I started commentary with Tekken Tag Tournament 2, but I was blessed to have the opportunity to actually do commentary for the very early days of Tekken 7. And that was for events, and I believe I was able to do it for just the pop-up event, uh, or rather a pop-up stall by Bandai Namco at ESGS back then. So it wasn't even out yet. They just provided some machines. So being able to do commentary for that, uh, it's just an absolute pleasure and it's a treasured memory for me. Who's the character that you hate or dislike in Tekken 7? I definitely am not a big fan of Akuma. Like in the right hands. I believe that there are a lot of people who actually don't like the character or the idea. The 2D mechanics is uh, it's really hard to implement and I think the Tekken team did a really good job actually putting them in there. Uh, we got Akuma, we got Geese, even Noctis and Elisa. But I'm glad that we're getting back to the Tekken mechanics, the roots of the Tekken mechanics with Tekken 8. So, we mentioned with Tekken 8, what are you looking forward to in Tekken 8? One of the biggest features that I've been wanting to really see in Tekken is the crossplay. Ah. It's something that really divides the community because we have players in different platforms and they don't get to play with each other. But this time around, everyone's going to be playing with each other. And not to mention, we have the ghost feature which allows us to uh, play the actual uh, or, uh, copies of the players without actually having to play with them. So there's so much innovation going on with Tekken 8 and it's just super exciting to be able to get my hands on them uh, in a few days. Please tell us your name and your IGN you po kapag naglalaro po kayo. Uh, Ron. IGN. <laughs> ano pong ganap niyo today with co-op? Ayan, Tekken 7 3v3 final tournament. Uh, I'm one of, the, one of the casters. What is your best memory with Tekken 7? Ah, I got to travel a lot because of Tekken 7. So not only in the Philippines but also outside of the country. Um, is there a character that you hate or dislike within the Tekken 7 roster? May love-hate relationship ako sa mga characters eh. Like may characters like uh, like Akuma. I enjoy watching yung mga combos ni Akuma pag hindi ako yung naglalaro. Okay. Pero if, if going against Akuma, tas sa akin, you know, nagagalit ako. So ayun. <laughs> what are you looking forward to with Tekken 8? Tekken 8 siguro. Um, what I'm looking forward is not in game. Probably it's ano, it's more of uh, community growth, especially here locally. Mas marami sana maglaro, mas uh, tumaas yung level of competition, and uh, mas marami pang mga hindi players na subukan nila maglaro ng Tekken 8. Ako po si JJ Quinn. Um, is that it? Okay. JJ. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. And um, anong ganap mo here today for co-op? Okay, yeah, so uh, kami yung nag-handle ng stream ngayon for the Tekken 7 uh, 3v3 final tournament na co-op uh, gaming lounge. And yun, actually partner kami to be the one handling the stream na uh, for the tournament. And you're also a... Caster. Yeah, I'm also a caster, so I'm casting for the tournament as well along with Porokun and Hot E. And, you know, they have been quite a delight to work with and and so really look up to them as well and being able to cast with them is just a privilege. What's your best memory with Tekken 7? <laughs> okay, uh, best memory with Tekken 7. <laughs> okay, so I'm not gonna I'm not going to say the name, but this is one tournament I registered last minute and yung una kalabang ko is yung Tekken Crush ko before. So <laughs> So I'm not saying na natalo ko. Uh, sa kanya, really good, really good player, pero basta na yung kilig eh. Pero, ang gal pero magaling talaga siya. Who's a character that you hate in Tekken 7? Siguro I would say, ano, Xiaoyu. I used to play Xiaoyu Tekken 6, pero I never started playing competitively until Tekken 7. And the way I played Xiaoyu and the way people play Xiaoyu, yung mga Xiaoyu players talaga is, you know, there's a huge gap between our playstyles na... Even to this day, I don't know how to play against a Xiaoyu. Uh, Send on Lex, sorry, but I hate your character. So, our final question, what are you looking forward to in Tekken 8? <laughs> Jun Kazama, baby! Let's go! Let's go!
Thank you to everyone who participated in our interview and thank you for watching this video. If you like this video, please click on thumbs up and subscribe to our YouTube channel. You can also find us on Facebook at DNE. This is our last Tekken 7 content, so please do treat us well for Tekken 8 as well. It's just around the corner, so get ready for the next battle. Oh, oh, oh.